We head on over to Manila South Cemetery. Our Gerard de la Peña will be reporting to us live from there. Gerard, what's the latest from your end? Denise, we are seeing hordes of uh, visitors going in and out of the Manila South Cemetery today, All Saints Day. And uh, the number of visitors practically ballooned compared to yesterday, even if the cemetery management already saw thousands of visitors who came over in the past couple of days. The Manila South Cemetery management is expecting foot traffic today to reach 300,000 up to 400,000. And that is double compared to last year's 200,000 when uh, there were still uh, strict health protocols and that children were barred from entry. As you can see, visitors can freely enter and exit the 25-hectare facility. To prevent crowding, the cemetery management opened an access along Kalayaan Avenue. Children can tag along and visit this time, but their guardians must register their names near the main entrance so that kids are accounted for. The management also provided the facility to help visitors locate the resting place of their loved ones. The management also put up a tent where visitors can come for medical concerns. Visitors are also reminded that they are not to bring items that it cost fire as well as sharp objects, paint, bicycles, and pets. Visitors are also encouraged to bring their own trash bags to maintain cleanliness within the facility. Denise, just a reminder for those who are uh, planning to come over here, entry is only allowed up to 5 p.m. and that visitors are allowed to stay only until 7 p.m. The cemetery management admitted that the facility is not that well lit and that the time limit given to visitors is only meant for their safety. Denise. Thank you, Gerard. Again, that was Gerard de la Peña reporting from the Manila South Cemetery.